Plantar fasciitis is a condition that people get in the bottom of their heel. Uh, it's caused by when there's inflammation around the plantar fascia. The plantar fascia is a band of tissue that attaches to the heel at the medial tubercle and fans out through the foot up to the toes. What happens is people get pain in this area, especially upon rising from bed in the morning, or if they've been on their feet for a long period of time at work, uh, possibly standing on concrete, they get a lot of pain in the heel. Plus, if they sit for a long period of time and they go to stand up, they'll get a lot of heel pain. A lot of patients complain that it feels like there's a marble that they're stepping on when they first get up and walk. Uh, very painful to the heel area. Usually people that get this are runners, sedentary people as well, people that don't do a lot of activity, obese, diabetes, people with flat feet, or sometimes people with a high cavus or a, a, what we term a high arch foot. There are a few things at home that you can get started with to treat plantar fasciitis. One is rest. If you're a runner, cut back on some of your mileage. If you're a worker that's on your feet all day, try to get up off your feet sometime. Take a break if you can, but rest. Activity modification is number one. Number two, ice three to four times a day for about 15 minutes to your heel will definitely help. Number three, some anti-inflammatory medicines such as acetaminophen or ibuprofen may be of benefit but please contact your family physician before you start taking those medicines to make sure there's no interactions or health concerns with taking those. Uh, number four, you can do uh, heel cups or insoles to your shoe to help give you some cushion, and you can usually buy those over the counter at a local drugstore. Um, and the next thing is to start doing some stretches, uh, which is a, a towel stretch, a wall stretch, and a step stretch. One stretch that you can perform even before you step foot out of bed in the morning is the towel stretch. Take a towel to bed with you the night before. Basically in the morning, before you even step foot, take the towel, put it around the ball of your foot, and pull your foot backwards, stretching the heel cord, trying to elongate the plantar fascia. Hold that for 15 seconds, and then relax the towel for a few seconds and then reapply pressure and pull your foot back to further stretch and you can do that five times in the morning. You can also repeat this several times throughout the day and before you go to bed at night. Another stretch you can perform is called the wall stretch. It's performed by placing your arms in front of you positioned on a wall, taking your affected leg that has the plantar fasciitis and moving it backwards, putting your heel flat on the ground and slowly leaning your body forward, keeping your heel on the ground, and thus you can feel a stretch on the heel cord and the plantar fascia. You hold this for 15 seconds, then relax, and repeat this stretch five times. In the afternoon you can re repeat this, as well as in the evening before bedtime. A final stretch that you can perform is called the step stretch. It's basically where you position yourself upon a step, such as this, and position yourself so that you're not going to fall. So you want to grab arm rails and basically what you do is you move your foot back into position with the ball of your foot up on the step and allow your heel to fall off the back of the step. Thus creating a stretch into the plantar fascia. You basically hold that stretch again for 15 seconds and then you relax. And then you repeat that stretch five times and then you can again do this multiple times throughout the day as you need to. And again, especially before bedtime. So if your heel pain is not improving after doing these conservative measures, please contact your family physician for further treatment options, which may include formal physical therapy, potentially injections, potentially other heel inserts or night splints. But eventually this heel pain will go away with these conservative measures.